Hello all, so I am currently going out to pick up the what was the orange Ford Transit Mark 6 beaver tail weighing in at 2 tons. Just had the call to say it's all up and ready, so counted me money, I've got me pennies and me pounds together to pay the bill. And yeah, one step closer. So next on this transit we've got to get the winch sorted, get the roof beacon on, possibly a little amber at the front and one at the back in the grill and the rear um, and yeah you never know I might have another job on shortly I'm just going through the dreaded Sandon Road shortly it looks pretty damn flooded is there any uh, custom for me we'll soon find out took a call last night for a lad that hit these bollards because apparently the little warning thing's gone well hmm don't know driver error if you ask me Right, let's pick up the transit. Oh, right, they look nice, that does, doesn't it? Fucking yeah, hell. Really fresh out the factory, that, fresh out the factory. I tell you right. what, yeah. And the mileage. Clean as fuck. Oh, of course. Huh? Oh, ah. Put on my YouTube channel. Looks all right, that. Oh, let's get out of here. Icon bodies. Bloody beautiful. Right, time for the next stage. Finally got the Transit Mark 6 back, it looks brilliant and obviously they said that it looked really good and the paint was very clean before so yeah happy days, hope we've got a nice little truck there. Uh, perfect for light transport, um, I'm going to have it sign written saying light transport as well, you know you've got the best, one of the best payloads is on that truck right there. Towing at home at the minute with the Nissan Navara, no point getting the big accident unit because it's light enough and this vehicle is rated to a ton lift, 
that vehicle weighs combined two ton so we're only lifting up half of the vehicle give or take we are on the ton so yeah happy days towing absolutely fine no bother at all just going to pick up a chinese on my way home because i'm very very hungry and that's it thanks for watching this clip will be part of some other clips that i've got lined up uh yeah see you later thanks for watching morning tubers so today is saturday we have got lots on the to-do list today so first things first transit mark 6 tilt and slide we are going to fit the new isolator and we're going to fit a not as long um power lead also got the new hydraulic pump that will be fitted today and get rid of lots of the old pipes and replace them with new as we need reliability come winter and rtcs and light recovery work for the transit gonna possibly try and redo the side markers if time is on my hands gonna take off the old battenberg reflective stickers and hopefully again if time is on my hands we will fit the new reflective tape we've also got a new beacon bar in here from chris at commercial vehicle products rather than me having four side markers on each side i've ordered six so i'm going to try and go for three because they are longer so that should do the job front middle and back doors locked uh, i don't know if you can see in there i've got the new hydraulic pump as well moving forwards onto the mark 6 transit which i've not revealed this video of the paint job yet but fuck it may as well show you now it is dirty because i towed it back on the spec lift as you'll see on the previous clip so we've got all this sign writing all done and agreed that will be done sometime next week obviously got a new beacon bar to go on this one as that one is pants gonna put some new spots on it new winch on it already got me straps and gonna put the reflective tape on the side of this one as well but when i get to there i'm probably gonna have to stop it and then start again because of obviously the bracing bracket on the bed maybe moving down to the jeep the jeep xj dun, 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 dun. just going to have some new windows at the house um just currently mounting this beacon bar on the roof rack reasons being it gives me that extra little bit of height um and you know that's just something i've done in the past and putting them on roof racks is a lot easier drilling the holes and sticking on it's only one cable going into the roof rather than four and more so yeah that's that project um moving along i've already posted this one on facebook but spreader bar that come from germany off tow truck trader is now installed so got the new bracket i might just snip some of the bolts off underneath um but yeah the bracket is on I am going to put some type of a safety security thing or a chain around it just somewhere just for safety and security. Although it's only parked here, I'm full of cameras, but you just never know. And yeah, that's about it for now. If you do like what you see on the channel, please make sure to like and subscribe for more content at GDB Rescue and Recovery. Thanks for watching. Current update, hydraulic pump is nearly installed using the old hydraulic tank for bigger capacity, which was a smooth fitment. Just waiting for my mate Rich to come back now and plumb it in, and that will be on the road. Moving forward onto the transit. Ta-da! Got the new beacon mounted on the roof. Just going to change the rear spot lamps now. Put some nice new LED ones on. And Danny's got the fun job of putting all the roof line in back together again. Cool. Rear spots. Yep. Yep, beautiful. Spots. Yep, fantastic. One done, one to go. Woohoo! Yeah, give me a bit of beacon as well, a bit of quick bit of beacon footage. Oh, that's bloody gorgeous. Oh, yes. Look at that. Whose horse is that? New spots installed left and right. Cables to tidy up. Our survey says. Ta da! Woo woo! Yeah, absolutely gorgeous, mate. Thank you. Beacon complete. Project spotlight left and right complete, minus the wiring, which I'll tidy up in a sec. Currently on project wing. Is it a boy, is it? Yeah. You just done delivery of it? <laughs> yeah, it will be hot. <laughs> Oh yeah!
Beautiful. We are not a million miles away now. That is the new LED beacon bar which was bought from Chris at Commercial Vehicle Products in Tamworth. Honestly, the camera's probably not doing it justice, but for the money I paid, that is an amazing beacon. Like, can't even explain how bright it is. And obviously the lights, they were also from Chris at Commercial Vehicle Products in Tamworth. Looks absolutely the business. For a little transit beaver tail, perfect. We put some new tires on the back, slightly lower profile. The angle is just impeccable for a three and a half ton truck. Absolute breadwinner.